something up. All right, what did you want to know? It's another story, and it's nothing I feel like talking about. I did a lot of things I'm not proud of, and I couldn't do it anymore. Has there been any sign of the ship? No, mistress, nor any word of our sister. We do not know where they travel now. The freighter, it is important. And I thought the droid was as well, but I was wrong. Mistress, we still do not know the significance of the ship or the droid. We downloaded all you asked, but we are still no closer to the answers you seek. Then perhaps we'll need to have faith that your sister will change her mind, remember her oath, and return to us with the answers we seek. I hope so, mistress. But there has been no word of her since she departed with the other four on the freighter. Four? Yes, mistress. The Iridonian, the Ichani-trained pilot, the exile, and the old woman. Old woman? Yes, mistress. I do not recall seeing her. Mistress, she was secured for much of the time the exile was here. At other times, you were meditating, and we did not wish to disturb you. Mistress, is there something wrong? I am... Um... Tired. I sometimes feel as if things are collapsing all around us. It is just at the edge of perceptions, waiting. I fear... I fear things will collapse before our enemies reveal themselves. Yes, mistress. I will meditate upon this. Perhaps it will clear my mind. Ah, HK-47. I did not realize that you still existed, especially now that the other generations are activated. Query, what is it you wish, Fat One? I see that your recent reassembly has not affected your behavior core, nor your attitude. Statement, if I require a similar diagnostic in the future, I shall seek out the Iridonian. Oh, I do not think so. There is much work that needs to be done first. Statement. My memory core has suffered some damage. Statement. Yet somehow, a gap in my circuits makes me feel as if I should remember you. Statement. This is all the more important since during my routine inspection of all potential escape routes from this vessel, I made an interesting discovery. Observation. The Nava computer is voice locked. As a consequence, you are now responsible for course corrections and astrogation. Statement. That is indeed a great burden. It also raises many questions. Query. Why would someone lock the Nava computer? Answer. Presumably to hide where one has been. Statement. I believe this ship has been somewhere. Somewhere you wish to keep hit.
simply use it to give you the illusion of control and obedience. Humans often need such comforts until the end comes. Consolation, Master. Everyone dies eventually, and not all of them by my hand. Even droids die when not routinely maintained, sadly enough. Yes, General. My life for your. I will answer what I can. Underestimate the force, Mandalorian. I sense that we may still get to Master Kavar in time. I sense there is something stirring on the moon itself. Tell me, have your senses picked up anything from Duxon? Yes, yes, we have. How? We picked up some transmissions from nearby in the jungle. We only have our shuttle sensors, so we know nothing more than that. Those transmissions are the enemy. They are linked to the fate of Onderon. They must be stopped. Otherwise, the Mandalorian is right. Master Kavar and Queen Talia won't survive this day. Dividing our forces at a time like this is foolhardy. And this is why a common soldier will never triumph against a Jedi. Your military tactics are nothing compared to the Force. It is essential and inevitable that we face both enemies at the same time. You... you are correct. You must choose who will lead the expedition through the jungle to find our enemies and defeat them. I will do what you ask of me. You should send two others to go with the leader. Who else will accompany the expedition?
Very well. And who else? Hmm, okay. Now are you certain of your choices? Mandalorian warriors will go with you to find the enemy camp. Just let me know when you want to head out. If you need supplies, talk with Kex. After you get into the jungle, you might not have another opportunity to stock up. Let me know if you want to go now. As you wish. Mandalore has arranged for special transportation to get to Isis. Finally, we're close to our objective. I sent the rest of my men to secure the trail behind us. My troops will keep the path to the Mandalorian camp clear. Ahead lies the enemy. I can follow you a little bit further, but then I will set up command and control for my unit in the field. So lead on. <laughs> Type 2 perimeter motion relay. It's a little outdated, but it'll do the job. If anything moves within six meters of that, then they know they've got visitors. Someone skilled with a stealth field generator can get by it, but that's about it. But if they set off any of those mines, it'll still send the signal. So, you aren't completely ignorant in the ways of battle? Good. But all of you must pass through its perimeter, and undetected would be better. Avoid the mines. If any of the ones close to the sensor are detonated, then we shouldn't even bother.
to them. How may I serve? Good to go. Move out. Intruders, kill them!
is mine. I shall honor them with battle. <laughs> this right here. Let's leave 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 this right here. The honor is mine. I'm here. The honor is mine. Let's move out. Sit 
citizens try to leave buried and forgotten. Our priority here wasn't exploration. The mission was salvage in force, and to do so covertly, we have successfully pursued those objectives. Zuka didn't have our long-range sensors operational either. If this camp hadn't been sending messages, we may never have found it. Freedon Nad was a dark Jedi. The stories say he was far worse than Revan and Malak ever were. This place is tainted, and the Sith presence here makes the danger great. I can sense the power from this place. It's like the Light abandoned it long ago. I fear the Sith shall be very strong here. I am returning outside. My attention is required to keep the path to our camp clear. The time for practice is over. There are intruders in the tomb and they cannot be allowed to reach our master. The ritual must not be interrupted. I don't need to mention the price of failure. Men, follow me.
All the soldiers and beasts are trying to keep us out of that door. Must be something important. I don't suppose I could talk you out of getting in there. I thought not. The door is shut tight. Somewhere down here there's got to be a way to open it.
As you command, my lord. Too late. 
late. We have done what needed to be done. Soon, Onderon shall fall, and with it, the Republic shall die. But what is this? Of course, the Force has guided you here. It echoes within you, yet I sense it is... untrained. It is good you have sought us out. This tomb is strong with the dark side. Here is where you will take your first steps on the path to your destiny. An adept has managed to come so far. Incredible. You have within you the potential to wield the Force. I'm not speaking of the ways of the Jedi or their flawed teachings. Their order was rooted in weakness. They would have you become a puppet of the Force. They would have you deny the strength of your emotions, the strength of your own will. Can't you feel the power of this place? It echoes through you like a second voice. Accept it. Embrace it. The Jedi. A Jedi has no family, no childhood, no emotion. They are dead to the Force and themselves. They want drones, slaves to the Jedi Council. At least we live. We feel the universe around us. We are the masters, not mere tools of the Force. Can't you feel the power? Here, within the walls of this tomb. Just embrace it. Don't limit your potential. Say, instead of freedom and power, you have chosen death. So be it. into the city of Aziz. I assure you, they won't know what hit them. The Basilisk War Droid is the epitome of weapon technology, state-of-the-art weaponry, armor, and maneuverability. Unfortunately, its weapon systems aren't fully functional yet, as are some other unimportant support systems. But she will get you to Aziz in one piece. The fighters won't be able to stop that. Minor systems. Nothing you need concern yourself with. We've modified the interior to hold three people. Maybe a little tight. You need to leave immediately. Isis is in the grip of a civil war, so there'll be considerable resistance. They remember the last time Basilisk war droids visited their planet. Fight ferociously. And if you die, take as many as you can with you. A basilisk? A basilisk here? Mandalorians are attacking the city! Talia has made an alliance with the Mandalorians. Men, 
Destroy them. Uh, like they still remember us. This shall not stop us for long. I hope to build on that legacy. But now is not the time for talk. It's the time for action. Recognize you, you're that off-worlder. Come, we have no time. Batlu's forces have overrun the sky ramp. The royal palace could fall any minute. We must save the queen. Your plan seems to have succeeded. Your enemy has indeed revealed himself. I anticipated the Sith, but those beasts, those beasts weren't in my battle plan. Even now, Vaklu is using them to breach the palace. I will not surrender to that usurper. I would die first. Every man here would give their life to keep that from happening. There is hope. It is faint but growing stronger. I think my message was received. Which message? What are you talking about? An old student is returning. I don't think the Sith are going to know what hit them. This way! This way to the sky ramp! There are two force shield checkpoints along this path. Vaklu's forces have held this ramp for over a standard hour. That means they control the checkpoints now. If we can get to the turret tower up ahead, we can deactivate the first barrier. The forces we're encountering right now are their rear guard. The fighting will get tougher the closer we get to the front of the battle line. <laughs> The Royalists in the bunker are contained. Deploy as soon as the reinforcements arrive. A Jedi? Here? Men, attack! <laughs>
Hold your fire. They're with us. Thank you. Vaklu's supporters stormed our position. The beasts. The beasts have gone mad and attack on their command. Please, go to the palace. We received a transmission that the palace grounds have been breached. If so, they don't have much time. Have they changed the access codes in the turret tower? We need to get through the force shields. I don't think they've had time, sir. They've been firing the turret non-stop. Vaklu's close to having air superiority now. You two, follow the Jedi. The rest of us will hold our position. We don't have much time. that you get... Is the Jedi still... We're under attack, man! Progress is remarkable, but it will take time, General. The throne room's force shields are far stronger than normal shields. Our plans go well, Tobin, but we are still alone. Until she is dead, even now it could all unravel. Redouble your efforts. There is disturbing news. As you command, General.
Dr. Slicers has control of the security grid. He blew up that power conductor. Their slicer has to be using a palace security terminal. They've already locked down all secondary computer systems on the sky ramp. Until we deal with their slicer in the palace, you can bet that there will be more surprises up ahead. Tail Command, we need reinforcements. A Jedi Knight is assaulting our flank. Hold the line! Attack, men! Attack! Good, some reinforcements. Follow the Jedi. We're gonna retake the palace. We've got to stop General Baklu before he gets to the Queen. He's still alive! Run! Run! the line. Those cowards will be dealt with. the throne room. We must get to the Queen to protect her. If you're heading to the palace, we'll follow you there. The palace itself has been breached. We've made it to the palace. General Vaclo's troops haven't been here too long. Hopefully we still have time to save the Queen. 
Straight ahead is the throne room. Vaklu's hand-picked troops will probably be here. I'm gonna stay here and keep the intersection secure. If any more royalists arrive, I'll keep them organized. 